Well, the view host Sunny Hostin is causing a stir on social media. Mercy, I feel like she often does after sharing an article about how the right wing uses language as a weapon. And she said this quote from a legal alien to states' rights to politically correct to now woke, the Republicans have perfected the art of language devoid of concrete specifics, but charged with big feels. End of her quote. Wait a second. I thought woke was their word, not our exactly. word. Exactly. Uh, but this got me thinking about how the left just likes to make up words to fit their narrative, like how pregnant women are now birthing people. Oh and you can't call it breastfeeding anymore. It's chest feeding. <laughs> And one of my favorites, renaming Latino or Latina to Latinx to be more gender neutral. It's unbelievable how they literally think that everyone's offended by this. So we need to change the words that other people are offended by breastfeeding mothers. There's only one group of people who can breastfeed and it's mothers. Uh, I can tell you because I <laughs> breastfed a lot of my kids and that's too much information. But it is an outrage for mothers who, you know, think that that's so important for their families. And the mere fact is, is that this is the left's agenda. They want to change, not only transform our country, but transform our language. And let yeah. me make this very clear. As a Hispanic, you have an L and a LA, okay? And that is how they do it. It's the feminine and the masculine. And the mere fact that they're trying to change us into gender neutral, we got to push back as hard as we can. Yeah, so not only trying to change American language, but another culture's language, which is offensive and should be pushed back upon. Uh, so it's it's not us, uh, Sunny. Watch out there. <laughs> well, Mercy, it's always good to have you. Thanks for being here with us on set today. It's been great. All right, well, that's our show. Thanks for being a part of our company. We hope to see you right back here tomorrow. Hi, Rob Carson here. If you love watching Newsmax, you're really going to love listening to our new podcast. It's called the Newsmax Daily. I host it, and I give you the best briefing of the big news of the day, top newsmaker interviews, and even, yes, a few laughs. I know it's hard to believe. So if you're uh, driving, walking, exercising, just about anywhere, you can connect with the Newsmax Daily with me, Rob Carson. Find our podcast online or go to iPhone, Spotify, iHeart, Stitcher, and more, and start listening today.